Hello, welcome back again to my YouTube channel. This is Mahesh and today I will discuss about how to write the objective questions answered in Lok Sheva examinations as well as any competitive examinations that we will have to attend in future. So, as a team, I am here in Yosurkhet in Gulbule Park. I am here in the out movement. I am here in the video. I am here in the video. I am here in the video. I am here in you're messing with my heart and I still wanna love you I wanna spend my life Okay, now we're going to make this video Let's start the video Tips 1 Understand the questions The first and most important tips for writing subjective answers is to read and understand the questions carefully Pay attention to the keywords in the questions such as analyze, evaluate, discuss and compare these keywords will give you a clue about the, what the question is asking for. Make sure you answer the questions asked and not related to the tangential questions. Tips 2. Plan your answer. Once you understand the questions, take a few minutes to plan your answers. Write down some key points, arguments and examples that you can use to support your answers. This will help you to organize your thoughts and ensure that you cover all the relevant points in your answers. Tips 3. Write a clear introduction and a conclusions. Your answer should have a clear introduction that sets the context and the conclusions that summarize your key points. The introductions should briefly explain what your answer will be about while the conclusion shows the main arguments and the fundamental thoughts that you provide. Tips 4. Use examples and evidence. To support your arguments, use examples and evidence from the questions or from your own knowledge. This will show that you understand the subject and can apply your knowledge to answer the questions. However, be careful not to use irrelevant or unsupported examples that do not add value to your answers. Tips 5. Be conscious and well structured. In subjective questions and answers, clarity and concession are the key. Your answer should be well structured with each paragraph or each addressing or specific points or arguments. Use the clear points, concise language, avoid repetition, and stay focused on the questions. Tip 6. Proofread and edit. Finally, submitting your answers takes some time to proofread and edit. Check for spelling, grammar, and punctuation errors and make sure your answer flow logically and coherently. Okay, so uh, there you have it, some tips on how to write the subjective questions and answers in Lok Sheva examination. Remember to understand the questions, plan your answer, use examples and evidence, be conscious and well structured, and proofread and edit your answers. With these tips, you can write effective subjective answers and uh, egg your exams. Thank you for watching and good luck for your examination. Wait, 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 wait. I have some information about my YouTube channel. Guys, I have a YouTube channel ma upload a video on YouTube channel. I have a PDF on my 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 YouTube channel. Okay, now goodbye.